Greetings and welcome on down to whatever the scum this is that you and I do here. I noticed the Guyana Defense Force is benefiting from five drones to aid in the force's security efforts in border and maritime surveillance. The drones are being funded from the 14 billion allocated to the GDF in the 2019 national budget. This is great news and I'm happy that the GDF is getting these machines. Of course, you know, the inner scunt hole in me had to look at the price tag and bring your attention to the thieving conspiracy. Stay tuned. Hey, something ever surprised you like when you see Jigala war? Before we get started, I would like to invite you to become a member of this community by pressing that red and white subscribe button and turn on post notifications so you can get updates when we post new videos. So, the price tag for these five drones come in at a whopping $180 million, which is $36 million a piece, which in US dollars would be $171,000. The company supplying them is called Skyfront. When you go to their shady looking website, there's no price listing. But I did some digging and found that the average price for drones with similar specifications is between 10 and 15,000 US dollars. Guyana is paying 171,000 for the Sky Scun. I mean, Sky Front. I scoured the internet and could not find any drone within this class or specification that costs anything close to 20,000 US dollars. Which means somebody is pocketing millions of dollars from this deal. I have a few questions for the procurer. What was the competitive process used to select this supplier? And why the Scun do you think 36 million dollars is a reasonable price to pay for a hybrid gas electric quadcopter? I would like for someone, anyone, to logically explain this modest scum to me. Like this video if you like it. My name is Murwato. Boom out! So, while doing my research for this video, I filled up the form on the Sky Scunt website requesting a quote. I specified what application the drone is intended to be used for, and instead of getting a quote, I got a response from one of their representatives informing me that they are in Ghana at the moment, and I should give them a call for them to answer any questions I may have. I did have a question. What is the price? I don't know what you think, but this shit stinks to me. Hopefully the regular media channels can investigate this and get to the bottom of it. If you have questions of your own for Sky Skunt, you may contact them on WhatsApp with this number here. Hold up.